In this video, I'm going to show you how to stop the verticals wheel route without having to shade underneath in Gun Bunch. Now, this defense comes to us out of the dollar three two defense, but it is um, something that's universal. You can do this out of multiple formations. If you want to get my full dollar three two defensive ebook, make sure that you join our Patreon. Uh, the link to do that is in the description. We're going to be revamping that ebook the next couple of days. And Patreon members get access to not only all of the ebooks we already have, but all the updates to those ebooks and any new ebooks that we release as well. So if you want to get signed up for that, the link is in the description. So in your coaching adjustments, you're going to want to put your auto alignment to base um, in the 46 playbook. And we're going to come out in the play spinner. So this is a man blitz. And what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and press our coverage. And you're going to see here that it's going to do this. Now, the only adjustment we need to make to stop the vertical's wheel route, and I'll show you first the problem, is that we can just quick throw this wheel and just obliterate man coverage. So to stop this quick throw wheel, all we need to do is we're going to manually back up the corner that is guarding that bunch receiver, and then we're just going to man that blitzing linebacker up on the tight end. And we're going to stand about right here. I like to crash my line down. Um, I think it makes the blitz significantly better. And then from here, we can actually go ahead and, you know, do some other things as well uh, within this within this play. So, you know, some other little adjustments however we want to. But the real benefit is if I try to snap throw this wheel route to beat the blitz, a lot of times it's either going to be broken up or it's going to be intercepted. So again, the main setup here is we're just going to manually back off that bunch receiver, and then you can pretty much press your defense. And from there, uh, I love to crash my line down. I think it really does help the blitz, and you're going to get this double-edged pressure, and it's really hard to make that wheel uh, or that quick throw wheel. Now, the other thing that we can do uh, with this defense is that, that the running back quick throw is now going to be an option. So what we can do uh, with this from an adjustments perspective is we can basically go ahead and do this right here where we're going to scissor adjust, basically. Um, all I want to do is kind of move this guy a little bit. That's going to help kind of not make it so obvious that we're putting him in main coverage over there. So if they try to quick throw the running back wheel, we have that covered as well uh, within this defense, and we're still able to send a significant amount of pressure. Now, in the ebook, we actually go over a couple of other things that you can do uh, from this, you know, from this defense to be able to stop stuff. You know, I think the actual, you know, act of just taking the safety here and letting him, you know, kind of rob over the middle or whatever is just fine. Another simple adjustment is a hard flat um, or to, of course, go ahead and just man him up over there. Now, another one of my favorite adjustments is to do some variation of this right here where we're going to have a hard flat that's going to shoot out against the tight end quick. Then we're going to have that tight end cross man with a safety. And then if the running back stays in the block, you'll notice that dollar's so good, a lot of times you'll get somebody free off the right side um, as well. This is what makes this defense so, uh, so, so powerful in my opinion. Uh, so again here, you're going to see, you know, if we wanted to, Maybe do an adjustment that looks kind of like this, where we're dropping that coverage, extra coverage to help the tight end. Now all we have to do is if the running back stays in the block, we're just going to lurk in the middle of the field. And you see how good of a blitz the dollar is. Dollar doesn't necessarily come in free every single time, but it causes glitchy disengages if it doesn't come in free. So there's so much we can do with this, but the biggest key here in this defense is we want to make sure that we're always bunch uh, dropping that right side uh, guy that's in the bunch we want to drop him back, uh, and that's going to help significantly as it pertains to stopping any kind of quick throw uh, to that side. And now we don't have to worry about shading underneath. We're able to just kind of play our man coverage and be very effective. If you want to learn the rest of the dollar defense, make sure you join my Patreon. I'm going to put a link to that in the description down below. It's only $10 to sign up for the Patreon. Gets you access to all of my Man 23 offensive and defensive ebooks, as well as any updates or revamps. We're dropping a brand new ebook there this week for you guys as well. So make sure you're in the Patreon if you want to check all that stuff out. Head down to the description below if you want to sign up for the Patreon. The link is down below. Thanks for watching, and we hope to see you over at the Patreon page.